Algebra 2 CRAM, New York State Algebra 2 Regents, Common Core, Key Facts, Trigonometric Graphs. Question 3, y is equivalent to a the sine of bx plus b. To order this complete CRAM session, inbox me at kneemedicine at gmail.com and be sure to tell your friends and classmates who also need to review to order this CRAM review. Okay, let's delve into this problem together. Review question three. What is the phase shift of the function y is equivalent to five the sine of three times x minus 0 0.6? Is it one, five up, two, five units down, three, five units to the right, or D, five units to the left? <laughs> when I said D, I meant four. I'm intermixing the A, B, C, D, one, two, three, four answer, answer systems. All right, so definitely press pause at this time and I'll give you a moment to think. So hopefully by now you've arrived at an answer. If you haven't, that's fine. Let's try this out together. In the equation, y equals a the sine of b times x plus c, um, the phase shift is equivalent to the variable c, okay? It's how far the beginning of the cycle has been translated horizontally, okay, in the direction of the x-axis. The value of C um, gives the number of units of the phase shift, but the sign tells the direction. Okay, so our phase shift C here, or this, you know, represents the concept of a phase shift. Positive um, means a move left, and negative means a move to the right. I know this might seem kind of backwards, but trust me, that's what occurs, okay? In this problem, we're told that the phase shift is um, 0 0.6 units, and that's negative, so therefore it's 0 0.6 units to the right. Therefore, the correct answer choice is going to be answer choice three, okay? And for those of you who like the ABCD multiple choice system, it would be answer choice C, which also rhymes with three. So we have a phase shift. Basically, that's 0 0.6 units to the right, okay, as shown here. All right, thanks for your time. And again, be sure to spread the word and to order this complete review session Email me at memedicine at gmail.com for pricing and also tell your friends, classmates, colleagues, whoever's struggling in Algebra 2 to email me as well so that I can um, deliver them their cram session package. All right. Thank you.